Air Gemini, and welcome back to Star Lord as Tarot. I am trying something new uh, by demand, popular demand. I've been asked to try some love readings, so I'm going to be pulling three cards, uh, three cards spread for the time frame of July the 16th to the 31st by weekly readings with my brand new deck, which I absolutely love. So let's get started, Gemini, on your uh, love reading. Uh, pulling the three cards now, and we shall start the interpretation. Oh, these cards are so slippery. Okay, so card number one represents the issues right now. You have the Seven of Swords in the upright for the issues. So, uh, it could be with the Seven of Swords here, it could indicate, Gemini, that perhaps you're having some issues uh, uh, dealing with people that are uh, either being kind of sketchy. It could be that um, in your relationship, perhaps there's some things that people, uh, yourself or your partner, are avoiding just don't want to deal with it right now, trying to get away, trying to be, you know, really stealth in uh, how they're dealing with it. This could be you as well. Maybe you just don't want to deal with certain issues in your relationship right now, or even relationship uh, issues in general. Perhaps you're just trying to you know, get by in a sense without sort of putting your whole heart and soul into something. So that's what you have for your issue card. And your second card is the reason. And we have the three of wands here under reason. So the reason in the relationship or in your you know, love life in general, could be that you're working towards something right now. Maybe you have your mind on other things. Perhaps you're more preoccupied with building something. Maybe you're working towards something in, in a sense that you're uh, trying to build for your future or find some kind of stability right now. And perhaps uh, that's what you're trying to avoid uh, dealing with your partner if you are partnered. Or even if you are sort of single and looking, it could be that you're more focused right now on other things completing something. The Three of Wands is very progressive energy. It's about completion. Perhaps you want to, you know, get your career up and running first, and that's maybe a priority right now. Uh, you know, home, maybe uh, purchasing a home, building a home, or something like that is more where your focus is right now. And number three is the action that should be taken moving forward we have the strength card here in the upright well gemini it's the strength card like i always say in my readings i always welcome when the strength card comes because what it does is it it helps us to get in touch with our own inner strength so at this time, you probably need to be drawing upon your own inner strength in order to overcome perhaps any difficulties that you might be dealing with with the partner with the Seven of Swords there. Uh, perhaps you have to draw upon your own inner strength at this time in order to move past uh, difficulties, to move past uh, issues that you could be having with your partner. Uh, you could be just needing to deal with your, like bring on your own inner strength to be able to deal with both your career, whatever it is you're building or you're doing right now, as well as perhaps take care of your partner because you don't want to be neglecting a partner. So you're going to need to pull on that inner strength. Now, it's the gentle strength that we all have within us. It's not that brute strength where we just force something. So as an action card, don't force anything at this time, I would say. Just draw upon your own inner strength. Your inner strength will help you to get through this period 
um, where you could be struggling. It seems like you're just struggling because you want to avoid dealing with, uh, with emotional issues, it looks like at this point. So, or if you're dealing with a partner that could be kind of sketchy, it could be that uh, you just, you know, your focus is elsewhere and maybe you're just turning a blind eye to what they're doing. And uh, it's like, Lord, give me strength. <laughs> this too shall pass, Gemini. All right. Well, that's what I have for you. Let me know in the comment section below uh, if this resonated for you and, and what you think of the uh, love reading. So take care for now, Gemini. I really hope this reading helped you. If it did, please like, share, and subscribe. Bye-bye for now.